Holding steady, nice and straight. Got the fan right here right now running it. Beautiful. Alright guys, there it is. Totally done. Got it hooked up, produce some electricity. Check this out, turbine's running, down to the leads. Light's a little bulb. It's a little incandescent light from the flashlight. A quick video to show you how to make one of these mini homemade wind turbines with the oscillating generator on top. Okay, so this is basically how it goes together. The adapter screws into the top of the union. Then I'll put a small piece of PVC in between here. Three inch section maybe, three to four inch. Put the motor in here and the post at the bottom. All right, now just take the union, screw the adapter in the top, then take the piece of PVC you just cut, push it all together, tighten it up, alright I went ahead and took the cardboard tail fin off and I made a couple out of plastic now, I actually just got them out of an old waste basket. I'm going to go ahead and attach them roughly like this. Alright, I'm going to use these to connect the tail fin to the post. Those should just slide right in there like that. Put the other one on. And there it is. Alright, then just put it on the stand. It should look like that. Just choose any small propeller, I like the three bladers, and it, the propeller just snaps onto the top like that with a little prop adapter, like that. Now I'm going to go ahead and solder the wires to the end of the motor, and we'll drop it in. Notice it's kind of loose right now, so I'll take some electrical tape, or I'm going to use black duct tape. We'll wrap it around a few times. I'll fit in there nice and tight. All right, now I'm just going to feed the wires down the tube. Let's drill a hole here so the wires will have somewhere to come out of. Do.
All right, then twist the wires together and feed it down the tube. Now just gently feed this in. Okay, that's never coming out of there. That's it. It's done. Alright, the last thing I'm going to do is put the stops in here. Drill a hole here and here. Insert the two small screws. And that'll stop the post from rotating more than 180 degrees in either direction. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead and drill a hole here and insert a screw. That'll keep this from moving when you want the stops to work. Now this thing won't move at all. It's nice and tight. So the stops will work correctly. Pretty cool. Got them hooked up to the back, goes over, up the pole. Here's just another quick idea for the turbine. You can use it as a battery charger. Just hook up the wires from the generator on the motor to the cradles, some battery cradles, buy your rechargeable batteries, drop them in, fire it up. You can also charge up bigger batteries too.